हेलो स्टूडेंट्स एंड वेलकम बैक टू बैंक एग्जाम स्टडी डॉट कॉम सो पी एन बी एस ओ मैनेजर क्रेडिट एंड रिस्क एग्जाम्स आर गोइंग टू बी हेल्ड ऑन ट्वेंटी सेकेंड टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस वट यू शुड स्टडी वट शुड बी योर एग्जाम स्ट्रैटेजी एंड हाउ यू शुड अटैम्प्ट द एग्जाम वट टू डू इन लास्ट टू और थ्री डेज दैट कैन बूस्ट योर स्कॉज दैट्स वट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टूडे फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल द एग्जाम पैटर्न देर इज क्वांट रीजनिंग इंग्लिश एंड प्रोफेशनल नॉलेज सो वन मार्क ईच फॉर रीजनिंग एंड क्वांट एंड हाफ मार्क फॉर इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज एंड वन एंड हाफ मार्क फॉर द प्रोफेशनल नॉलेज राइट सो हाउ यू शुड अटैम्प्ट द एग्जाम द फर्स्ट थिंग यू नीड टू डू इज अटैम्प्ट प्रोफेशनल नॉलेज अटैम्प्ट द प्रोफेशनल नॉलेज इन द बिगनिंग सो एज यू कैन सी यू कैन नॉट करैक दिस एग्जाम विदाउट स्कोरिंग अ गुड मार्क इन द प्रोफेशनल नॉलेज राइट मोस्ट ऑफ यू आर वर्किंग प्रोफेशनल्स राइट so till now what you have done is you have prepared for professional knowledge right uh, quantitative aptitude and reasoning take time these subject they they take time right i mean inko time lagta hai acha score karne mein but but professional knowledge you can score with whatever your existing knowledge you have or whatever you have gone through in my courses or online you apne kara hoga attempt professional knowledge in the beginning and then uh, one of these a quantitative aptitude or reasoning you can attempt quant in the you know uh then quant and then reasoning and then english language that should be your strategy are you getting it that should be your strategy professional knowledge quant reasoning english right how much time you should allot total 120 minutes are there but no sectional timing is there so you need to allot time according to you you need to allot time according to you so first of all uh like 30 30 minutes are is enough 30 30 30 minutes to both reasoning and quant i know it's not possible to solve 50 questions within 30 uh, minutes but you need to allot time you need to have a plan otherwise you won't be able to you know see the easy questions out of these 200 questions 100 would be like easy right 50 would be at an uh, average i am telling you according to my experience 50 would be moderate 50 would be hard it will be difficult so what is your job to find all the easy questions and a few of these moderate questions and score like 90 100 that is your target so start with professional knowledge and then 30 30 minutes here and then i would say like uh, you can uh, give 30 if you if it's possible uh, to attempt within like 25 minutes that will that is great 25 to 30 minutes it is it is possible and like 25 to 30 minutes here and whatever the time left you can give 5 minutes to you know that is your buffer time right so 5 minute to reasoning or 5 minute to quant you can give right at the end that is what you can do you can mark your question at the end you can do this but uh, what i recommend you if you are taking more than 30 minutes if you are taking 35 minutes or even 40 minutes uh, that is totally fine that is totally fine but do not spend one hour here your whole exam would be ruined so 30 minutes or 35 minutes is okay for one section move on to english language try to give just 25 minutes to english language 25 26 minutes right and then uh, you know these sections 30 35 minutes right that's what i recommend stick to the your plan make your own plan and stick to it start with professional knowledge then move on to you know quant and then reasoning than english that is my plan but your if your reasoning is stronger than quant you can attempt reasoning uh, uh right after professional knowledge i i recommend you to attempt english language at the end because one question is equal to half mark right uh because even if you are uh, if there is shortage of time and you are unable to attempt all the, uh, the easy questions let's say you are able to attempt just 20 questions they are not able to attempt rest of the questions you are losing half uh, half the mark you are going to lose in reasoning and quant okay so let's say uh, you you could solve 10 extra questions in reasoning right so you lost 10 marks so let's say if you could solve 10 extra questions but you didn't solve it because attempted it because of lack of time you are losing 5 marks so that is my strategy always attempt professional knowledge in the beginning and english language at the end uh so it could be second or third uh, the quant and reasoning it could be second or third okay that is my strategy okay so what to study in these last uh, you know i guess 3 days now okay rbi is circulars that's what i recommend 
प्रायोरिटी सेक्टर लेंडी एन बी एफ सी लेंडिंग एन बी एफ सी रेगुलेशन एच एफ सी रेगुलेशन यू सी बी रेगुलेशन डिजिटल पेमेंट सिस्टम रेगुलेशन बैंकिंग रेगुलेशन एंड कोविड मेजर्स बाई आर बी दीज आर द वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स आई हैव ऑलरेडी कवर्ड दम इन माई कोर्स सो यू कैन चेक इट दैट यू कैन चेक दैट एज वेल सो दिस इज द लास्ट टू डेज बूस्टर फ्रॉम माई साइड इफ यू आर डूइंग दिस थिंग दैट कैन फॉर श्योर बूस्ट योर स्कोर बाई ए टू टेन मार्क्स which is a huge number if you have never done that that can boost your scores by 10 marks in last 3 days it is possible legal topics every year in the all the credit officer credit manager exams two questions are asked from the sarfasi act and trust me it is just 3 pages of content right so for the last 3 days that two that two questions can be there from those 3 pages and always there is one or two question from basel norms again 3 pages Banking Regulation Act just five pages. Negotiable Instrument Act just seven pages, I guess. So, Basics of Companies Act is little deeper, I guess. I'll do another video for you, the basic questions of Companies Act. So, I'll do a video for that. So, it's part of the course again. A very important points that can fetch you at least seven to eight marks. See, I mean that is a difference between a student who is unable to crack the exam and the one who is able to crack the exam. एट टू टेन मार्क्स है सेवन टू एट मार्क्स है इन द प्रोफेशनल नॉलेज एफ एम आई होप यू हैव यू आर ऑलरेडी डन दैट मोस्ट ऑफ यू आर ऑलरेडी डूइंग दीज थिंग्स ओनली बट येस रेशियो एनालिसिस वर्किंग कैपिटल कॉस्ट ऑफ कैपिटल दीज आर आई वुड से मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स रेशियो एनालिसिस वर्किंग कैपिटल मैनेजमेंट कॉस्ट ऑफ कैपिटल रिस्क फेज बाय बैंक एल ओ सी दीज आर मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स विच द वन आई एम मार्किंग these are most important topics ratio analysis is the most important topic every year two three questions are there from ratio analysis please remember those 16 ratios remember them by heart and weighted average cost of capital the cost of equity retained cost of uh, equity please remember that the formulas there are seven eight formulas in cost of capital please remember that letter of credit is an important topic every year one question is asked break even point ke sirf do formula and just two formulas just go through that depreciation i hope you are already aware about it the types of depreciation portfolio management the just one formula to calculate the beta the same simple formula that's it that's it don't go in depth that's what i recommend you so we have already released the test series for pnb so credit the link is available in the description five full length mock uh, mock test for each for risk and the credit sectional quizzes are there uh, complies with the latest exam pattern explanation for each and every question is there and discussion form is there systematically designed and we are covering the entire syllabus and if you want to take the course for your revision i can provide you 50% discount you can get the the whole course for just 2000 rupee that's it so just 2000 rupee that is the cost of course for 3 days right that includes a test series so if you are taking leave that can be of great benefit instead of uh, instead of doing the research that can help you so video classes notes uh, uh, the complete plan for whatever i told you here rbi's official website legal topics and these topics the fm topics whatever i'm uh, discussing here uh, so that that's what you can do so these are the important topics right that's what you can do to boost your scores by at least 20 marks and that can help you to crack the exam right and even the interviews because the exam has a weightage in the interviews as well 80% weightage right so uh, that's all for today list of students who cracked the ibps so marketing using our classes bank of india credit officer rrb scale to journalist officer bank of baroda wealth management vijaya bank credit officer why i am showing you this these pictures bank of india uh, students successful students of bank of india credit officer why i am showing you these pictures to let you know that we are specialist we know what what we need to do for the specialist officer exam we exactly know what the examiner is going to ask in the credit officer exam most of you are doing this thing it's good it's fine but this is also important and this is also important so that's uh, what you need to do link to the both the course in the test series is available in the description you can check it and subscribe to my youtube channel and like this video That's all for today students thank you and have a very nice day